Welcome back to another Nutcracker compilation, everyone. It's lowbrow, it's shameless. I'm basically proving that the 2006 movie Idiocracy was, in fact, a documentary. I'll bloody give the common folk the content they want to see. Three, two, one, order up. His testicles are a pair of pikelets. Let's watch a replay in real time, purely to be sadistic. Ow, 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 my balls. Step away, young fella. Haven't you done enough damage? The leading cause of nutsack-related injuries has got to be kids. Hey dad, thanks for everything that you do! He fucking lays there for a second and regrets buying gym equipment. I feel like he's mumbling in ancient Latin. Be gone demon child, the power of Christ compels you. That's what it translates to, roughly. Careful, careful, careful! Oh, there's a knee! Dad down, dad down! He yells, bugger this, I'm leaving. Call me when you're growing up. We'll get to know each other then. Nah, he's passed out before getting to the door. The dog walks in and says stiff shit. Actually, Cricket has a lot of ball bag injuries too, alongside parenting. Sure, you get to wear a box, but his family jewels are still bloody shook. Anyway, he carries on. Oh, it happens again. Fuck me sideways. Even the polite commentator that wouldn't laugh the first time gives in and has a cheeky chortle. This time I gotta laugh at this. <laughs> the ump is thinking, be professional, be professional, be profession. Here is block number one and block number two. Good defense overall, really. Oh dear, it's another resistance band video. This guy's future unborn kid is messing with him. It's me to me to keep picking on kids, isn't it? What I said makes no sense! If the Queen's death gets a public holiday, this bloke's cock and balls deserve a public holiday too, I reckon. Beware of the penis fish! That's what scientists call it, because it obliterates the penises of male humans who partake in fun recreational water sports. OMFG, it's another dad. I hate to bang on about it, but we know he's responsible for whatever baby maker bruising we're about to witness. Oh, ha, ha. oh yeah, no, yeah, the reverse bloody hoodie trend prank thingo. Did this actually legit catch on? Sometimes I can't tell when trends catch on or media outlets force them to catch on. I don't know what you'd have to gain by forcing this to catch on, though. I sound conspiratorial. Those were his balls. The haughty missile was going for a spank of the buttocks. Unfortunately, it turned into a battering of the beef stick. And maybe that's how this trend ended. Enough people saw that video and thought, screw it, dodgy, dodgy trend. Overall, what good is hurting your dangly bits without an audience? He managed to stick that landing. Nice. In comes his mate with an intense competitive streak. He has butchered it. Laughter ensues. <laughs> Please do whack the like button and you'll get 10 years free protection on your gonads. Go to aussiemanshop.com for all your merchandise, link below. And go to aussieman.com slash submit to send your videos in, link below. Cheers.